Hello, my name is Kimberly White and I am hoping to be at your camp next summer. Um, I'm going to do a short video on how to make masks. First of all, I cut out templates using bits of paper um, and then I transferred them onto bits of card. I've already cut them out to save time. Um, I use my craft knife for that, so that would be an Adam's job at camp. Um, next is the process of putting it all together. This bit I will use masking tape for, but you could use anything really, like glues, etc, tapes, other, time, other types of tapes. So, let's start by putting it together. So I'll start using my head bit first, and then getting the tape, I'll then just start building up bit by bit. This would you can already see that it's starting to take shape. Well, I can. I'll have it up in a minute. Right. So, as you can see, it's kind of difficult to tell. But there is the sort of basic face. You can kind of see it taking shape. Right. As you can see, he looks like Lilo. Um, now, I am going to paint it all white so that when you add the next colour, it won't look. It, the colours will be bold. As you can see, I also need to let it dry before I can paint over it again. Just painted it white and you can start to see all the facial features in there. And I will show you some of the other few bits I've done while we wait for that to dry. Um, I have done a fox mask. That one is made out of paper mache, so it is rock solid. Obviously it's 3D again, so you can, yeah, gives you the effect of the nose. Um, and again, that's just used, uh, covered in paint. Um, I've also just made a simple mask for the boys, Captain America. Uh, yeah, that's just, again, it just needs your string so that you can attach it. And again, that's something you can make into a project. You can make the whole outfit, you can go for the chest plate and the shield, you can go crazy with that one, that's a lot of good, good idea. And also, I've made a letter. Now this is a cool idea because you can decorate it and personalise it however you want, or you can leave it blank. I thought that you could get all your little campmates, uh, everyone that you've made friends with, to sign it at the end of camp, and uh, yes, then you have a souvenir to take home with you. So. I will be back in a couple minutes once that's dry and we will carry on painting and we'll see the end product. See you in a second. Now then, let me show you. Now that's what it looks like so far, but I will do another coat once that dries, but this is going to take longer to dry, so I will just post a photo of it at the end. So, that is pretty much how you make a mask. Uh, like I said, you can go into loads more detail and you can make it as simple as you want. Uh, I have recently made a parrot mask, but unfortunately I haven't got that because my friend liked it so much that she asked if she could have it for her fancy dress, so she has taken that. But there is a photo of it on my application form. Um, that is pretty much everything I have. So, thank hopefully I will be seeing you next summer as a craft counsellor at your camp. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.